This one is a standalone expansion to the existing game, and it's going to introduce new game modes like versus and a free for all, but it will also introduce some new characters and some new mechanisms as well. If you're not familiar with the original all-time wrestling game, the reason it has that name is because this actually features both real and made-up wrestlers from all points in time. Each wrestler does have their own asymmetric deck of cards, and players are just going to be selecting a subset of those cards to start the game out with, and when you're selecting those, you just have to stay within a certain total damage amount. During a turn, you're going to be spending energy to play attack cards from your hand, and there might be a skill check as part of that attack in order to determine if it's a success. Landing a success not only deals the damage, but it can also gain you momentum, which makes skill checks easier for any additional cards that you play in that combo. Chaining cards is possible by matching certain icons and keywords together, so that might be a consideration when you're deciding which cards that you want to start out with at the beginning of the game, and then also which cards you want to add into your hand as you get opportunities to upgrade your deck. Players will also have different finishing moves that they can use to pin down their opponents, and if you get pinned in this game, you're going to have to roll a skill check in order to get out of it, and that skill check requires you to roll a value below your current health, which means that the more damaged you are when you do get pinned, the more difficult it's going to be to get out of it. There are also ways that you can permanently discard cards from your hand, and if you lose all of your cards, then you will lose the game. And the game also offers a campaign mode that introduces a whole lot of variety from game to game, and of course a ton of opportunities for players to level up their wrestler and make things a little bit more interesting with each subsequent game. If this one sounds interesting to you, you can check it out, I'll have it linked down below.